What I have here is a Lazy Susie. It has a very good bearing, so the friction is pretty low. So once I accelerated it, it will almost continue at the same angular velocity for a very long time. Now, if you apply a conservation of uh, angular momentum on this situation, there is a few things that we can observe. First, if initially there is no angular momentum, so no rotation at all, I need to apply some torque in order to get it to speed. The longer I apply the torque, the faster it will get. Torque times time gives me the change in angular momentum. So now it's rotating. Now a classical thing that we can do is we can change the angular or the rotational inertia of this platform. What if I add some masses to the edges? So now initially the system consists of a rotating platform and two masses that do not rotate. So initially there's only the angular momentum of the rotating platform. Once I drop those two guys on the platform, they will start rotating with it. So we would expect what? That the platform speeds up, continues traveling at the same speed or slows down the moment I drop this. Well, let's have a look. It clearly slowed down because now the total uh, rotational inertia is bigger and the initial angular momentum of the platform is now distributed on the platform and the two masses had rotate as well. 